Welcome to the Trump Breaking News Network, your daily source for up to the minute Trump news. Join us today and every day. Here's today's news. This is TBNN. Trump rips McCain for criticizing Yemen raid in which SEAL died. By Kyle Feldzer. President Trump went after Arizona Senator John McCain on Twitter Thursday morning for criticizing a raid that ended in the death of a Navy SEAL, several civilians, and a destroyed V-22 Osprey tiltroner. McCain has been critical of the first military raid ordered by Trump, refusing to join the White House line of calling the mission a success and instead deeming it a failure. He softened his language later but still called the said not a success. White House Press Secretary Sean Spicer said any criticism of the raid was disrespectful to Chief Petty Officer William Ryan Owens, the SEAL who was killed in the raid. Spicer demanded an apology from McCain during a briefing with reporters on Wednesday. Trump said McCain shouldn't be talking about military missions altogether. Senator McCain should not be talking about the success or failure of a mission to the media. Only emboldens the enemy. Trump tweeted. He's been losing so, long he doesn't know how to win anymore, just look at the mess our country is in, bogged down in conflict all over the place. Our hero, Ryan died on a winning mission, according to General Mattis, not a failure. Time for the U.S. to get smart and start winning again. Asked to respond to Spicer's criticism, McCain told MSNBC on Wednesday that the success or failure of a mission is not linked to the bravery and heroism of those who carry it out, something he learned from personal experience while being held as a prisoner of war. Many years ago when I was in prison in North Vietnam, there was an attempt to rescue the POWs. Unfortunately, the prison had been evacuated but the brave men who, risked their lives in an effort to rescue us prisoners were genuine American heroes. Because the mission failed did not in any way diminish their bravery and courage and willingness to sacrifice for their fellow Americans who were being held captive, McCain said. Mr. Spicer should know that story, he added. That's the news. Join us here every day. Be sure to subscribe and click the bell. See you next time. This is TBNN.